Hey guys, Peter Popart here, and um, I've been coming up with some ideas of what I could do to help, and one of the ideas I realized was if you go to peterpopart.com, you can find Grumpity Grump coloring pages from the Grumpity Grump storybook I did a while ago for your kids to print out and color. I have removed all of the color work from them, so it's just literally inked lines. Also... I've decided that I'm going to be doing a few times a week videos uh, for your kids. This way your kids have something to do while they are on lockdown from school. All right. So the first one we're going to do is literally just the art of doodling. I love to doodle and I love to sketch and this is not necessarily something for your kids to follow along with but maybe it's something that they can doodle along with all right I love sitting down and just coming up with fun shapes and then taking these fun shapes and creating something out of them um, kind of like freestyle you know, flow and just letting my mind go and not sticking to any hard and fast rules, but, you know, and not literally like saying, okay, well, this is where this needs to go because this is how it's done. More along the lines of let me be creative. And that's kind of what I want your kids or you to get out of today's video is just the ability to be creative and allow yourself to have creativity flow. Um, do, do your art the way you want to do it. I know that nothing that I'm going to be doing here is going to be super high level, super high brow. Um, you know, this is really just to show the kids in your lives that, you know, while they're drawing that they can sit down and just pick up a pencil and some paper and then just start doodling away and notice I, I very quickly abandoned one sketch concept and now I'm just moving on to another one and I'm not I have no clue what I'm doing I'm letting the the the, the shapes of everything that I'm coming up with dictate what the what the art is going to be let your kids do this too um if you have digital means by all means let them use it uh if they don't have the digital means absolutely you know just have them use both sides of the paper and you know give them you know whatever supplies you have handy and just let them kind of noodle away at the paper and when I do this stuff, I just kind of, I don't even really think about it. I just kind of go. It's kind of the way I handle all of my commercial work. Uh, what happens is with that is a client contacts me and they're like, hey, Peter Pop, uh, how's everything going? This is what we have in mind. Where do you want to take this concept? And I sit there and... I get a lot of freedom in my projects, which is really quite wonderful. Um, and I just sit there and I, I start banging out sketches. And I submit them and then we talk about them and it just goes from there. So right now, you guys, the kids have a whole ton of freedom. And the reason why they have this wonderful freedom is because this is all up to them to decide how they want to handle their sketches and their concepts. See, I put a little propeller hat on this guy. I don't know why. Uh, I just thought it would be kind of funny. So do your art, do your sketches, and have fun with it. Right now, the way I'm doing this is notice everything is all scribbly and scratchy. Now I'm going to move on to another one. Create another one. Why not? There's nobody to tell me what to do at this point in terms of my art, and I want to I wanna enjoy that. You know, there's, there's tons 
tons of just random shapes that you can create and you can just add to and enhance and try to figure out how you're going to turn it into something that looks cool and if it doesn't look cool and you know you would categorize it as you know a fail uh at the end of the day who cares you got to practice your drawing you got to relax you also gave your parents some some much needed relief let me tell you all right i know because I, i've got my three girls here and uh they're they're young and they're crazy and you know every five minutes it's daddy 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 uh which is great you know but you know i, I everybody needs everybody needs a break so you know and the kids too like you know you guys you just need to you you guys have are used to the structure of school and right now you know, you're kind of getting your break, but I have a feeling some of you guys might be getting kind of bored pretty soon. So, which is why I came up with this. And this is just, you know, literally just quick doodles, guys. You know, just me sitting down, not thinking about anything, not even working in the normal style I work in. You know, me just kind of having fun. I'm not taking any of these pieces to completion. Um, I'm moving quickly. Uh, why not? You know, why, why should I not, um, you know, why should I sit here and, you know, unless I fall in love with a concept, you know, why, why, why should I not, you know, just keep going, keep my hand fresh and enjoy myself. You know, art's about fun. You know, I, every project I do, uh, all my commercial work and I do a lot, a lot of commercial work. I'm very fortunate. I always have fun. I inject fun into the project. And it's why I'm as busy as I am. This is an arm in case you were wondering. Um, and that level of fun keeps the projects fun for me. The viewers love looking at the work. Um, it carries across. It's probably part of the reason why I've won so many awards doing what I do. It's I make sure that the fun is there. So, you know, yet again, look, boom, there goes another drawing. Uh, always move, you know, at a pace that you're happy with. I'm known for being a very, very fast artist um, uh, with a high level of quality, thank God. And I've always worked on my speed in terms of being an artist because I get a lot of projects that are quick turnarounds. And it's it's always served me well not all of these doodles have actually none of these doodles really have a start or an end really for in terms of i'm sitting down and i've got a list of things i want to draw i have no clue what i'm drawing before i start drawing it i'm just kind of tackling this and you know having fun looking at it nothing is like realistic or professional quality you know, but all my projects honestly do kind of start out like this. I I sit down and I read the brief. And for those that don't know, a brief is a description of the project that's at hand, what the objective is, why we're doing it, who the client is, that type of stuff. And I take that brief and I breathe life into it. And I come up with what I want to do. So what I want you guys to do is sit there and take a look at your doodles and, you know, your paper, I mean, and, and start breathing some life into your doodles and give yourself, give yourself a break every, you know, maybe, maybe what would be pretty cool and a lot of fun is if you guys every day sat down and came back and revisited this video or any new ones that I get up. And give yourself five minutes to doodle, 15 minutes to doodle. Imagine if you gave yourself an hour to doodle every day, how much better your artwork would get, you know? I mean, it would be, it would be amazing. So definitely, you know, maybe, maybe make this like a new, a new habit for yourselves. You know, you're sitting there. You're, you're 
you're antsy, you're you're bored. Well, if you're bored, you know, let your imagination take you somewhere. Uh, you might be really thrilled with where you end up. You know, it could be, it could take you anywhere. Like, you know, right now I'm taking myself to, you know, a dark and mysterious superhero. And I'm just kind of doodling, and just kind of having fun. You know, I bet you this guy hangs out in a cave you know, with bats and stuff, you know, and drives a really cool car, you know, and all that. Boom. There you go. Quick doodle. Incomplete. Just l knocking them out one right after the other. Um, you don't have to work large. You can work small. That's all up to you. You know, however you guys feel that you want to do the your doodle that's how that's how you do your doodle you know this is your art your time your chance to relax you know right now I'm just sitting here you know and I want I want everybody to just improve their their artistic game you know give yourself something kind of fun to do Improve your artistic game. Get creative. And see what you guys can come up with. You know, my, my, my company, Peter Pop Art and the Peter Pop Art Agency, you know, our tagline is we deliver art that pops. It's all about art that pops. And... It's about art that connects, you know, make your art connect with you, have it connect with other people, do your sketches, have fun doing your sketches, and get creative with it, all right? You know, if you want to get kind of realistic-ish with shadows, you know, you can cast your shadows. You know, you can draw whatever you want. You know, and this is just quick doodles, just having fun. And that's all I want you guys out there to do. I know that everybody's schedules and lives have been um, slightly adjusted, to put it lightly, and derailed. Um, you know, but for those of you that have art in your life, or music, or sports, you know, something, you can still fall back on that right now and embrace it and maybe rediscover it. You never know, you know. And for the kids out there that are working on this, have fun drawing it. Find your favorite cartoon character if you like and work on the doodles or maybe draw and create your own doodles. Why not? Why not? Why not just have a little bit of fun? All right. So listen up, guys. Remember, head to PeterPopArt.com and look for the Grumpity Grump tab and then download the Grumpity Grump color page, coloring book pages and please print them out have some fun with those as well and if you want you can share your doodles with me on instagram and hashtag peter pop art all one word or hashtag peter pop art agency all one word as well all right guys good luck i look forward to seeing the work that you guys create um and i will come back in a day or two with an additional video thanks a lot everybody i really appreciate spending this time with you i'll talk to you guys soon bye